So, recently, Ray Benson interviewed the Damn Quells, one of my favorite Oklahoma groups. So let's check it out and see what happened. The Damn Quails are the joint forces of Oklahoma singer-songwriters Gabriel Marshall and Brian White. Under the guidance of Red Dirt hero Mike McClure, the band put out a stellar debut album which includes the song, So, So Long. I think one of the cool things about what we do is that we spent a lot of time uh, before we signed any kind of record deal with, with McClure, before we even recorded the album, we were playing these songs night after night uh, at a little place in our hometown called The Deli. Uh, which is where we cut our teeth and it started out just me and Gabe and then Biggie started coming up John Knutson brought a few instruments and then a few more and uh, it just kind of went from there And so we, we learned how to dance around each other as opposed to stepping each other's toes So so long um, that came out of a uh, kind of I dared myself to write something um, listening to Wilco and reading a book about Wilco and uh, There was a quote in there something about Jeff Tweedy um, would write a song, I think it was too poppy, and he would, he would change it, make it weird, because he didn't want to be pop. And so I thought, I'm gonna write a, um, a Jeff Tweedy song that's actually pop. An idea pops into your head, you know, and, and 15 minutes later, you've got this song, and whether it's a great song or not, it's, you know, it stands on its own, and it's got a point. And, uh, you know, those are the special moments to me, like songwriting-wise. Sure have no life, babe I didn't know what else to do
Hi, John Fulbright. Hiding back there in the back. And a chair that just can't wait to meet you Parked at the top of the sand dune I got this brand new tattoo
There's a postcard, a letter mailed from Golden Shores of California. And a message sent solely to warn you. We're all falling in to the ocean. I heart you damn quails. Thanks for letting us use your video. Join us next week for more of Don and Friends. You know what? You just don't know who's going to be next.